Okay, this is a shocker. Quaker Oats is removing the name and image of Aunt Jemima from the brand in effort to make progress toward racial equality. We recognize Aunt Jemima's origins are based on a racial stereotype, Quaker Oats said, adding that the move is an effort again to make progress toward racial equality. And I grew up with Aunt Jemima syrup and pancakes. Wow. And I never saw it as offensive. Uh, now, the question is, did they mean it to be offensive? If they meant it to be offensive, if Quaker Oats meant for Aunt Jemima to be offensive, then yeah. But if they're just responding, then no. At any rate, the suggestions on Twitter are for Aunt Jemima to be called Aunt Karen. Yeah, that's right. Take a look. That's Simon Cowell. Okay. Saying, and then, man, they better not change Aunt Jemima to Aunt Karen. I'm not going to be harassed by syrup. Okay. Uh, this is... Guys, I've had an Aunt Karen, and she's actually very nice and well-educated. <laughs> and there, of course, is Oakland's Barbecue Becky, otherwise known as Jessica Schulte, reacting. <laughs> she's never going to live that down. This is... Uh, Let's just read. You sat back and said nothing when they tore down the statue of Thomas Jefferson. You fanned the when they announced schools named for Jefferson and Washington would be renamed. But now it's too late. You could have stopped this. Okay. Karen for Black Lives Matter. Okay, opens Twitter, sees that Aunt Karen, Mrs. Butterworth, and Big Muffin are trending, closes Twitter. <laughs> uh, what else do we have here? Uncle Karen says, Ben is next. <laughs> what is the world coming to? <laughs> uh, let's change the image to a white woman and call it Aunt Karen. <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy. <laughs>